Hello everyone and welcome to Let's Play New Horizons. Um, this is going to be the fourth in my walkthroughs for each character of this game. Uh, thanks to everybody that has watched the first three. I've received a lot of positive feedback and I'm looking forward to continuing in this series for you. The next character that I'm going to Let's Play is Otto Baines, the British privateer. As you can read there, he is appointed by King Henry um, to defeat the Spanish fleet in a secret covert mission. It says that he is 25, but he looks like he's about 50 because of all of his gray hair and stuff. I guess people aged much faster in the 1500s. Anyway, we will definitely help him battle for the glory of England, and we don't need to change his name. And off we go. So we got the startup screen here, and apparently we're at the cafe. So Otto likes to frequent the bar, apparently, which is, I don't know if that's a good thing or not. Anyways, there he is. He's wearing a green cape. Hello, old chap, I'd like a cup of tea. That was a horrible British accent, viewers, I apologize. Thanks, I needed that. Ah, oh, apparently we owe a lot of money. Okay. Ah, nice little compliment there. Ah, since we're a higher up, we apparently are getting sucked up to by the boss. <laughs> so once again, Otto just drinks for free. Hmm. Kind of like a little scam to me. Oh, Sir, Gil Sir Gilbert has been looking for us. Okay. Well, let's go to the palace and see what Sir Gilbert and the king want. I guess it's Sir Gilbert the king? Hmm. Maybe he's one of those uh, higher-up royal knights. Who knows? Okay. The king is waiting for us. All right. Now, who do we have here? Man, that guy just looks like a tool. Look at that. Look at his face and his... He looks drunk. And look at his, his mouth. He's like... You know. So you finally decided to grace us with your, your presence. And we're a busy guy, you know? We had to go drink some tea. <laughs> nice excuse. Perhaps we could talk after my audience with the king. Oh, apparently he doesn't think we're going to last very long. Hurry up, quickly. Okay, so for some reason, Gilbert doesn't like us. I guess he's jealous of all the success that we have, but okay, let's go see what the king wants. Ah, because there is something he must ask us. This is Henry VIII, all right? Anything, Your Majesty, yes. Hey, we get a warship. Hey, that's pretty easy, nice. Sweet. Hmm, there's a powerful nation that threatens our mighty land of England, okay? It's the Spaniards, apparently. They're trying to conquer all of Europe. Well, actually, it's the Turks that are trying to do that, but we don't need to talk about that until a little bit later. Okay, we need to make a strong war fleet, okay? Yes, we get to be the head of the Royal Navy. Sounds good. Okay, go out and gain experience at sea. Sure, no problem. We respectfully accept. Okay, we get weapons and a letter of mark. I like that. Okay. All right. We are apparently now are able to go and attack people. I like that. We're working for the King of England, and we already have a royal rank. That's cool. I respectfully accept your generous offer. Great. Oh, we get to take care of... Oh, we get to ask for as much gold as we like. Let's get 100 gold bars, just like the King of Turkey gives us. You don't need to worry about a thing. All right. So just like that, we've got a warship, weapons, a letter of mark, and a royal title. Well, that was easy. Pretty good way to start the game, I think. I see. Apparently Gilbert's waiting for us, okay? There's a sailor waiting to meet us there with a ship, and we get a ship, all right. Cool. Yes, give us our money. 300 gold pieces? No, that's not going to be enough. We can barely get, we barely have enough for food and water there. Stop complaining, this is more than enough. Okay, 300 gold pieces. Yes, we got this. Try to remember you are representing England. Don't embarrass us. Mm, you know what? I think we need to punch Gilbert in the face. I really think that would be a good idea. I'm really, I'm really starting to dislike that guy already. But okay, well, let's go get our ship. First thing we, first things first, let's check out our items. Okay, we got a really crappy sword, but better than nothing. And we have really crappy armor, so we'll put that on. Better than nothing. And the letter of mark basically means that we get extra fame and piracy for defeating fleets. And that's going to be important to build our fame and piracy as we go along. So, okay, let's go get our ship. I've come to pick up my ship. 
Ah, I was wondering when you'd come by. All right, let's see what we got. Ah, we got a nice ship. All right. If I was going to use to fight the Spanish, what would you think? What? What does that mean? Simpleton. Just... <laughs> Man. So Gilbert decided to name our ship Simpleton. Okay. Fair enough. Well, let's check out the ship, see what we got here. And a Caravella Latina, apparently. Yeah, that's really not going to help us very much. But I guess all great warriors got to start somewhere. All right. Well, let's go to the harbor then. And apparently there's a sailor here waiting to meet us. Hey, there he is. You are the noble they told me was looking to hire a mate like myself. Yes. And apparently, Otto's not very impressed. Oh ho, don't think I'm good enough for you, eh? Alright. So we're apparently going to get quite a welcome party from Matthew there, or whatever his name was. But, interesting. Okay. Well, let's go check it out. Okay. Meet you guys inside. Well, actually, I'll, we'll go through this right now. Okay, let's see what we got here. There's a few guys at the table. The Ha! Commodore. Hey! Dude, what's the deal? This guy wants us to throw him a party. Huh. I think you're confused, pal. Why would I want to work for you? Uh-oh, they're going to throw it down. Let me help you make up your mind. And it's go time. And just like that, we're in a duel. Okay. With our crappy sword and armor. Now, it doesn't really matter if you win this battle or not. Okay, let's see if we can get a block here. Uh-oh. Yeah, it's it is tough to kind of it is pretty tough to win this battle, um, just because you don't have great weapons and armor, and it, it makes no difference in the game's outcome. We'll get better stuff later on, but anyways, since it's a straight sword, oh, there's a good shot. There we go. And I'd probably just keep blocking since he does have a a uh, blocking sword. Thrust nine, gotta take advantage of that. Come on, yeah, another good shot. I like it. Okay, I'm going to try a dodge. I have a... Dang it! I knew I should have blocked. Oh, well. well I'm just going to keep coming back with my thrusts. That sounded kind of interesting there. Okay, but now watch. I bet he thrusts. Nope, there's another block. Okay, cool. And one more should take care of it. And... Got him. All right. And we took care of that guy. But, sadly, I'm actually running out of time in this video, so I need to stop here for the introduction. But next time, we will see the results of our battle with Matthew Loy, and we'll continue the introduction to Otto's Quest. But until then, this is BCS Buster signing off. Take care, y'all.